we say that we are more than just a physical body and that we have a spiritual side as well. In this video, we will look at the effects of drugs on the physical part and on the spiritual part, where the effects are mostly hidden. We will talk at the end about how to repair the damage. We are going to look at some of the effects of drugs specifically in the following dimensions. The physical world, the vital or etheric world, the astral or dream world, the mental world and the causal world. For more on these dimensions, check the video that is linked in the description. It is well known that drug use takes place all over the world and is especially high among young people. Often people take it up through ignorance or even seeking something spiritual or to have a spiritual experience. A drug addict can turn this vice into a religion and mistakenly thinks he or she experiences the real while under the influence of drugs, not knowing that these are just hallucinations. So let's look now at some of the effects of taking drugs, not just in the physical or three-dimensional body, but the spiritual part as well. Let's look at the effects on the physical body first. Here, a person gets older faster. Why is this? If we inhale through the nose, the breathing is directly connected with the sexual energy, the life force energy, and so we are wasting that energy. Gradually, it runs out, depleting the life force, and the person ages prematurely. If we take a look at the vital body, or ethereal body, in the fourth dimension, Normally, the vital body is a resplendent, bright body. However, in a person who takes drugs, the body is dulled and weakened. This body, which repairs the physical body when the body sleeps, loses its shine little by little and becomes grey, corpse-like. In the astral dimension, the fifth dimension, or the world of dreams, the person is seen walking around like an idiot, doing and undoing, again and again, repeating actions without purpose. Here the egos are being fed and developed. The drugs fortify them. In the mental dimension, we see that tissues in the brain are being damaged. They crack, rot, and are becoming destroyed. So a person becomes mentally imbalanced and behaves out of character. Even more serious is the damage seen in the sixth or causal dimension. Here, our consciousness or essence suffers the effects of drugs, and in this dimension it is extremely asleep, walking around like a drunk, about to fall to the ground. For someone trying to awaken their consciousness, it will take longer. So it's not just a three-dimensional damage, but internal damage. The harm drugs cause to a person who spends time consuming them is very serious. However, through the correct use of their energies and applying the techniques of self-knowledge, someone can heal themselves, reversing all the damage caused by the drugs in the internal part, little by little. One can recover by working to develop the consciousness, starting the work in the physical dimension. In this way, the different bodies are repaired and start to function normally, reversing the effects caused by the drugs. The person can return to normal, being able to start the work of developing the consciousness and removing the egos. Visit our website to learn more about the techniques of self-knowledge and how to develop the consciousness. Our courses are free of charge.